Hello everyone, this is Brady with Lewis Motor Company and today we're taking a look at our 2015 Ford F550 42 foot working height bucket truck. Now this truck has just under 167,000 original miles on a Triton V10 gasoline engine that starts right up and sounds great. You can hear that now. And an automatic transmission. This came out of the state of Maryland. It is a one owner vehicle. We bought both insulated buckets that they have. As you can see, there's the other ones hiding right there. Overall, this one's in really nice condition. Inside and out, it's got an AT37G boom. So that's a 37 foot platform height, 42 foot working height. You can hear the PTO come on as it should. It's got big boxes, nice tall boxes with plenty of storage. Inside and out, you'll see the truck's in nice shape. I'll show you around here. Tires all have deep tread remaining. Frame and underside looks really good on this truck. You can hear the U10, sounds great. Nice, quiet, smooth engine. Look underneath the truck here. It's really in good shape inside and out and underneath. We do have some power options, power windows, door locks, mirrors. As you can see, vinyl seat vinyl floor, but all of which in really nice shape. I really like getting these trucks in because they're really nice trucks. They take good care of them. And they have a nice budget to work with as far as maintenance goes. So they're pretty nice trucks. You may just kicked them off there on the PTO. There we go, <laughs> hit the brake. But nonetheless, 166,900 miles at the time of this video, nothing's wrong with the dash. It's just the frame rate on my camera here, but. No lights on the dash, thing runs and drives great. We actually drove this in about 40 miles and did great. Headliner's in good shape, floor's in nice shape. Everything appears to be functioning as it should. And this is an original truck, this is how we got it. We check them over mechanically and then we clean them. That's about the extent of what these things need. They keep up on them, maintenance is always done on time. Anything mechanical, they throw at it. So when we get them in, the chances are they don't need a whole lot, and this one is the case. We'll take a look inside the boxes. Like I said, they're big, tall boxes. Normally, when you have a bucket truck, you have the short boxes that barely cover over the wheels, but this one's a nice, tall box. I'm six feet, and it's almost a little bit taller than I am. So got plenty of storage, plenty of room in here for any type of tools or material boxes are in really nice condition there's hardly any rust shown very little wear they really don't use these trucks much good tires all the way around got deep tread on the rears here the drive tires you can see in there a little bit of surface rust but up and out of the ordinary Robert tie in the sky again we've got a 42 foot working height it's an AT 37g it's a nice boom it's on a lot of vehicles you can see he's high in the sky there it's pistol grip style control so it's very easy to move maneuver with one hand if you're a sign guy or anything like that this is a very useful truck pitch receiver it does have some type of wiring there just pole wiring in between the boxes nice diamond plate uh, covered in a bed liner type material to protect it, but in between the boxes shows really nicely And hardly any Bumps bruises cuts scrapes nothing really on this truck. You got some minor stuff just from use But overall a really solid truck. You can see the boom is operating as it should don't see any hydraulic leaks with this thing it Does everything it's supposed to do But looking down the side of the utility box, you see some minor scrapes, a little bit of bubbling uh, near the doors. But really nothing that we thought that was necessary to paint. It does have an onboard, what's called generator. It's electric generator. There's a switch for that in the cab. I haven't actually operated that, so I can't say if it works, but if that's a big thing, we can operate it and see if it works. But these boxes are in really nice condition, very low use. I don't see any rust or rot. And usually you'll see some surface rust in these floors, but really they're nice and solid. Got some nice 
rubber mats in each drawer it seems like and all of which is in good nice condition but Robert is going around town with this thing you can see it does what it's supposed to do we got our stove function it's a hydraulic stove But the truck operates as it should. Does everything it's supposed to do. Got a V10 gasoline engine. And we've had good luck with them. But just a nice truck. Like I said, we bought both insulated bucket trucks from the state because we know what they are. Insulated trucks are hard to find right now. It's got a really nice boom. Bucket trucks in general are hard to find right now. We're searching all over the country. We're lucky enough we were able to find these right in Maryland. Their state of Maryland trucks has been the only owner. As you can see, this truck is operating 100%. No issues, we drove it in. There's no stories with this thing. From what we can tell, it's quite an original truck. The yellow paint is the colors for the state of Maryland. This is just another quality truck from them. We are pretty strong with their trucks. We, we buy a lot of them and there's a reason for that. They all seem to be nicely maintained and owned and this one is no exception. Nonetheless, a great bucket truck. One that you can hop in and go to work with. You got strobe lights throughout, and work lights. You can see it's in nice condition. Not a lot of rust on this truck, 2015. With a little under 167,000 original miles. But you can check this truck out for sale on eBay. Feel free to give me a call, shoot me a message. I'd be happy to help you. I can ship this truck throughout the United States. Call me and I'll give you a quote on that. We are Lewis Motor Company. We're located in Clarksville, Maryland, which is just outside of Baltimore, Maryland. If you have any questions on this truck or any other trucks you have listed for sale, please do not hesitate to call. But again, a nice bucket truck. One, you turn the key on and you go to work. Nice gasoline engine, so no worry about any type of emissions or anything crazy like that. Hop in this thing and get right to work. Thank you guys for watching.